Good day everyone to another video here on Quick Street Sims. I am Quick Street and today's video is a celebration to the best community ever. Now I do appreciate my now 170 plus YouTube followers and the thousands of views that I've been getting every month, but this video is not about you. Unless you also play SES's software's massive and long living hits, Euro Truck Simulator 2 and American Truck Simulator. Now just the other day they posted on all their social outlets saying that they had a special treat for all the fans. Their Facebook page for ETS2 broke the 1 million mark. It was close when they posted the teaser and quickly surpassed that mark. So on their most recent blog post they shared some of their follower stats as well as the special treat that we are all going to be receiving. Uh, that is if you complete certain steps which we'll cover in a little bit. So just to run through, they have about 300,000 subscribers on their official YouTube channel. They've got about 180,000 followers on Instagram, 120,000 followers just on the Steam Developer Hub, and 235,000 plus followers on the American Truck Simulator Facebook page, you know, uh, including the 1 million now on ETS2. And just SCS Software's official Facebook page has over 220,000 followers and over 100,000 I think on Twitter. Though they also extended a huge thanks to all the modders, virtual trucking companies, and people like me, content creators, people that actually do better content than this one here. But they also want to thank all the hundreds of thousands of regular day truck drivers that help make this the best community ever. You can see that is the title of their most recent blog post. And that special treat that's going to be unlockable via a mini event through the World of Trucks page, but you will need to have your Steam account linked up to World of Trucks, which at this point I don't see why you don't have that already done because you can earn lots of cool swag for your in-game trucks as well as this new uh, prize, which is a paint job that's going to be available in both games. As you can see here on the blog post here, that's the paint job that is going to be for your truck as well as for your trailer. It looks to be it's a, a three colored scheme paint job. So I'm going to assume that all the colors are customizable. So you can modify them to your own flavoring. And since this is an official paint job, these will be fully rockable in Truckers MP. Now to earn this paint scheme, it is quite easy. You're going to, as I said, mention you're going to need a World of Truck account. And you will have to take care of this in single player mode. Even though these paint jobs will probably be available to use in Truckers MP, Truckers MP at the time of this recording, they're still working on the 1.40 development. Uh, right now it's uh, running 1.39.4. So you will have to use single player to unlock this paint job as of today. So to get this paint job, quite simple. All you gotta do is one cargo load in each game. So if you do it, if you only have American Truck Simulator and you do it in that one, you're only gonna get the paint job in American Truck Simulator and vice versa for Euro Truck. If you do them in both, then guess what? You get them both. And all you gotta do is a simple one contract of 500 kilometers or 310.68 blah 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 miles and you will earn this one through your Steam page. So if you've never done a World of Trucks event where you earn like either a little air freshener that hangs from your rear view mirror or uh, another paint job or something like that, once you complete the necessary steps through the World of Trucks event, you will receive a message through your Steam account. You click on it and voila, it is added to your game profile. So what we're going to be doing today is I'm going to be jumping into ATS because your, my Euro Truck game is still set back to 1.39 because that's the one I'm using on Truckers MP right now. Uh, but ATS, I am using 1.40 because I was doing a large map list. Uh, my first time ever doing the Pro Mods, the Canada, the Mexican Dream, I believe, and a bunch of other ones that... I'll probably be putting together my map list and the load order uh, really shortly, but I had to use 1.40 because I had to do uh, down by Colorado. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be jumping into ATS and we're going to be taking a ride into Colorado, which I've yet to go and visit yet. 
though it's gonna be all new roads for me and I think we're gonna take a ride up to Denver all right so here we are sitting in Santa Fe at the truck works garage just had the truck serviced as well as put on a new paint job from the last video that we did where we took a look at all the Idaho viewpoints link somewhere on the screen right now to that video but this is since they've added the hex coloring and the ability to choose on a, a more detailed color picker this has been my new paint scheme or the, the colors that is you know you are a fellow space nerd you might be able to recognize some of these colors and if you do make a comment down below let me know uh, what this truck color reminds you of uh, just a little bit of a hint in a couple days the national recognition day of this genre I, or we'll just say of a film is coming up so that that'll give you a little bit of a hint but what we're going to be doing is we're going to be picking up a load of vehicles from Santa Fe driving it up to Denver which should complete the best community ever celebration to unlock the paint scheme that just came out today now they had it posted on their blog post but I haven't seen anything on World of Trucks and I didn't see anything in game so I'm hoping though that since it they put it on their blog that everything is active all the other uh, blogs and medias whatever haven't fully caught up to that news cycle so we're gonna run a little bit more than needed it's probably 370 miles which is 60 more miles than we need but that should be okay so let's uh go pick up our load here We are playing this on single player. We do have to deal with traffic. I believe I do have some traffic mods set up on this one. And we will recognize all traffic laws to the best of our ability. We have about 27 miles until we're picking up our cargo, which I believe is at one of the train stations. So we will do a little bit of a fast forward time lapse starting now. Alright, so we're here at the Tesla dealership picking up a vehicle full of te or a trailer full of Teslas. And I'm not sure why it took us this long way around. As you can see, let's go over to the map. Stop, stop. We started at the trucking station, which is just down the road. Why it made us go all the way around, I, I don't know. We must be using MapQuest right now instead of Google Maps. way to Colorado with some Elon Musk mobiles. 
Nothing like delivering some uh, electric vehicles and a big old diesel truck. We are actually now going to drive by the garage that we just started off at. Oh, officer. So there's where we started. I, don't, I have no idea why the GPS took us the uh, long way around. Alright, we should be good on fuel. 378 miles to go. So it estimated 6 hours and 19 minutes. Game time. Got the green light here, so we go. Time we're going to be going in the opposite direction of the highway. Once we get on the highway, we will begin our time lapse again. Colorado, and we can bypass the uh, way station. Very good.
hate when traffic stops on the highway. Do not stop for people merging on the on the on ramp. Good God. Right, we had to stop at the Mack truck dealership here in Colorado Springs because I'm not keeping my eye on the road and looking at scenery and I decided to crash it. So we had to spend about 18 grand in repairs, so we're gonna get back out here. I'm gonna try to be a little bit more attentive to the road here.
Alright, we gotta go find where we're dropping this stuff off. Here we are dropping off our vehicles at Denver. Tolerable. Oh, not good. All right, we didn't make as much money as we wanted to on that, but that should suffice for the best community ever celebration World of Trucks event. Hopefully that did count. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to quit out of here and go look at my Steam page if it did count and if so we'll come back and we will take a look at those uh, paint new paint schemes all right now that we have completed our 410 or no sorry 310 mile 500 kilometer journey here we received this in our world of trucks my page area under the events Location of best community ever, your reward. There you go and click on that. Come on. Ah. Oh, that, it's already open. So you gotta go over here, you have your details, redeem on Steam. We'll sign in. Alright, and let me pop up my Steam page, I'll drag it over here. Got two messages up top. Two new items in your inventory. Two new items, okay. Oh, it's you get the best community ever truck and the trailer. So it's two separate paint jobs, of course it is. Alright, so let's go into ATS again and we'll check out these paint jobs. Alright, first up we're gonna take a look at the truck paint job. So right now we are sitting inside the paint shop here. Roll up. Uh, nope, that's not the one we're looking for. Best com community ever. This is the new one that we just got in. So it is actually a four-toned color scheme. Let's go ahead and we're going to... Apply my color scheme that I've been using here. Alright, so that is the truck side of it. As you can imagine, it is set for every official SES truck. So the paint scheme is modified for each one. That is kind of cool. I do like that. Alright, we're going to confirm that and we're going to go take a look at the trailer now. Alright, right now we have a trailer up here. We're going to take a look at the paint scheme here. Best community ever. All right, so the same four that we got going across here. Let's see. Oh, it's going to add our truck into it. All right, let's modify. Which one? Okay. This one on the third one. Oh yeah, look at that. Very cool, so it's a four color scheme that you can modify as you wish. And you got yourselves, you got your modders, your developers, content creators in there, and your regular drivers all being featured on a trailer. Which as soon as Truckers MP is up to date with 1.40, you're gonna see a bunch of these trailers 
roaming around all the different maps out there. And so let's, uh, we're gonna complete this order. Very good. And we're gonna, let's, we're gonna want to drive this. So let's relocate. Oh, we've got nothing in, in our area. All right, we're gonna have to play around with this a little bit here. All right, so we're gonna pick up our trailer. There's the trailer there. Hook up, and this is gonna be what we're gonna use for a little bit. Oh, so roll over to the other side here. Pull a bit out. Oh, the camera's a little wonky. Yeah, let's fix that. We'll go into Photo Studio. It's a little bit easier. There she is, the new paint scheme available in both Euro Truck and American Truck. All you gotta do is one haul of 500 kilometers, AKA 310 point something something miles. And then you will be able to earn this through World of Trucks. I right, thank you guys for paying attention here to another video on Quick Straight Sims. Until next time, see you guys on the flippity flip. Peace out.